Hello, good morning, welcome to your virtual tour on the 2016 Toyota RAV4 GX that you inquired on. Now this virtual tour, I'll be going through all the interior and exterior of this car, pointing out any scuff marks or any marks that needs to be noted at first point of sale, just so you know exactly the condition of the car before you make a decision, make a purchase or anything like that. Also, while I've got you here, let me just give you a quick tour of my yard in Cairns if you haven't been here before. Now, Pacific that I hold about 100 plus cars in a given time between two dealerships here in Cairns, making us one of the biggest dealerships here in the used department. Also, across the street there, we've got the brand new Toyota showroom, Lexus showroom there as well, and service and parts just behind it there also. All right, back to the vehicle now, starting with the front of the car. Giving you a zoom in on that front of the grill. Obviously in a white color there as well. And a clay coat on the vehicle there, still all in really, really good condition. And I said, if there's any blemishes or any stone chips or anything, I'll point out on this video. Nice big uh, headlights there as well. Nice chrome finish in there also, which is nice. Same goes for your Toyota badge. Now there has been a few stone chips here before, but it has been touched up prior, as you can see. Look, you will get general wear and tear on the vehicle, unfortunately, being a second-hand car. But overall condition of the vehicle there. Not too bad at all. Clear cut on the car and the bonnet especially. Still all intact, which is nice. Zoom out now from this angle. Work your way down the panel now. Front tire there as well. A lot of tread left there. Now these are, if I do recall, your 17 inch, okay? And your steel from Genuine Toyota. Work your way down. You get the contrast of black and white on the vehicle, which is a nice finish. Color coded door handles there as well. Nice chrome finish on the door handles also. Same goes for the mirrors, color coded. Nice big blinkers are there also. Roof also all in great condition there. Okay. Back window now. Breaking away down again. Fuel cap obviously on this side. Back tire, same thing. A lot of tread left also. Make our way to the rear. Very nice stylish looking vehicles. Very clean and tidy. Again, zoom in on that. Reverse sensors fitted to the vehicle as well, which is nice. Just a little bit of mark, a bit of dirt there actually. On there, but nothing too crazy. Bit of dirt there as well. Nice big RAV4 sign on the back. Just the bug fitted there. Nice big brake lights there as well. Same goes for here, on the roof. Nice little spoiler, and again the roof, all in great condition. Open it up just here. Then you've also got your reverse camera fitted just underneath there also. All right, massive, massive boot space in these RAV4s. And with the lip they're having here, this generally means it's got a full size spare, which it does, okay? And I think also, you're jacking your tools just underneath that there also. All right, just gonna fix that up a little bit. There you go. So, carpeted floors, no marks or stains or anything like that. Just a bit of dirt mark there. You've also got your protectors for your um, cabin. So obviously you've got your um, net there through to stop anything, any cargo is moving. It also stops direct sunlight there as well with your parcel shelf. All right, Turn it up a little bit. Very easy to use, like so. If not, they can come off fairly, fairly easy. Just a clip. Okay. Over here as well, you've got the cargo barrier. Very, very easy to use. Just screw and unscrew. Take it out if needs be, but those seats do also lay flat. As you can see, you got three anchor points there also. 
zoom out now from this angle. Work your way down the panel. As you can see, nothing major needs to be pointed out to the vehicle. Just showing you everything I can see. Just so there isn't any surprises on delivery or on pickup. Brush touch there, it's been done already on the vehicle, but nothing too major. Again, zoom out from this angle here. Make our way inside the vehicle now, starting with the back seats. Open it up. Speakers, cup holders, power windows, and each door. Very nice, very large looking cabin in this RAV4's family size, obviously. Carpet of floors and carpet of floor mats. Roof morning. All in great condition there. And as I mentioned, the seats, like so, and drops down. There we go. Lays exactly flat. Okay. Driver side door now. Open it up. Same thing again. Power windows, central locking, cup holders and speakers. Driver side door. Very nice looking interior, very sporty. Nice finish to them. Carpeted floors again, genuine floor mats. Same goes for the other side as well. Dash, all in great condition there. No discoloring or anything like that. Windscreen, no chips or crack or anything like that at all. Okay. Over here, you've got your owner's manual, your service history book, two set of keys, central locking in each one as well, which is nice. Owner's manual, I can't bring up the owner's details on this video, but it was a Department of Housing, okay, originally from Brisbane City. So by law, these cars have to be fairly, fairly regularly serviced. So 10,000 there was done, a black Toyota. 20,000 was done there as well. 30, 40. 50, 60, and then 70 was done there as well. See, so your next service isn't due until 80,000. Give the car a quick start. Sixty-eight thousand k's now on the clock. May one last besides my handbrake and my seatbelt. Again, reminder: service is up there. All right, get the car quick rev. No funny ticks or noises there whatsoever. Steering wheel, leather, all the way around. Big badge there as well for Toyota, airbag and horn. Volume control, next track or station. Mode, different stations, FM or AM or um, Bluetooth audio. You can also got hang up or pick up for your hands-free Bluetooth. Cruise control there as well and your display. You can go through different settings in your trip meter. Okay. Over here, you got touch screen display. CD player as well. Reverse camera fitted there also. Volume and tune station for scroll. You've also got your sensors up here, your hazard lights, okay, your time. Massive, massive air vents as well. Keep the interior cool. Aircon temperature, very, very easy to use. Okay. Over here, you've got your AUX USB port. 12 volt power port there also. You've got the eco and sports mode there as well for your different drivetrains. So holds the gears a little bit longer for you in your sports mode. So it changes maybe at six to 7,000 RPMs. Depends how much you're putting it down for your accelerate. Whereas eco mode changes the gears a little bit quicker, maybe between two or 3,000 RPMs. So you do have a lot of better fuel economy in the eco mode. Cup holders, reverse neutral drive. You can go up and down the gears manually yourself. First gear, second gear, third gear, fourth gear and your trip tonic, if not put on drive, park, handbrake, cup holders, and your center console. Okay, very, very easy to use. Very clean, very neat and tidy. Just popping up the engine now, so you can have a look at the, um, at the engine. So I pop the bonnet, so you can have a look at the engine. Just to see, it's very clean, very neat and tidy. 
no funny texts or noises there whatsoever. So there you have your virtual tour on the RAV4 all-wheel drive. Hope you enjoy and I'll talk to you soon. Thank you.